my name is Zach Ciotti, and this is my first vlog that I'm posting. And I'm doing this as a little test run just to share some techniques and little tricks that I've come up with along the way. So everyone has heard about Tilt Shift. Tilt Shift got popular, I don't know, five, ten years ago back in 2000. Tilt Shift has been around for a while. The idea is that you're tilting and shifting the lens away from the sensor or away from the film itself. The first time I tried doing this was in post-production. I didn't even know what it was called, and I started blurring the foreground and the background, and I came up with a certain look, which kind of made things look like miniature. In fact, I think the first time I saw it was with this great video. Now, to, to my understanding, it looks so tilt-shifty miniaturized, it might as well be a real miniature. I mean, it, color quality, there's almost this texture. And the angles of the camera, that's what really blew me away. Now, of course, I did this with photos, and I think most people have tried this out on their Instagram app. What I came up with was a way to do tilt shift with any lens. One of the first times I tried messing around with the lens in relation to the sensor was when I went out taking some photos of my beautiful wife. I simply removed the lens and tilted it slightly off axis. So anyway, I was working for this little boutique agency a little while back, and we did some gigs for H&R Block. They were actually all internal, so there were nothing national. Not very many people would have seen it unless they were employees, I think. And these pieces I've used for my portfolio. i um, been really proud of the way that I came up with this new method to fake tilt shift. And the place that I filmed it was actually just out my window from my hotel. This is a really good reason to have a good view from your hotel when you're out on a gig somewhere. I did this one time at night, and then in another instance I used an actual tilt shift lens. It was the cheapest one that I could get my hands on. I filmed it with both a Canon 5D Mark III and a Sony FS700. The one with the FS700 has a crop sensor, so it didn't look quite as spectacular. The idea is to take any kind of lens. In this case, I use a Canon 16mm 2.8 f-stop lens. And when I filmed out the window, I turned it out of focus, and then I turned it a little bit more out of focus, each time waiting about five minutes recording, and then I layered each of these on top of each other in After Effects and used masking tools to be able to move around the bokeh that I wanted to see. Using this method, as long as things look fairly static, you can have a very well done fake tilt shift. That's the first time I've ever shared that with anybody. It's not very personal, but I thought it was a cool technique. I hope you get to try it out and show me what you come up with.